Swayam Prabha Digital India Educated India So let's look at this particular uh, expression. So the same airship, 6000 meter cube, operating under same conditions ISA. If the PSP is increased by 49 pascals, calculate the delta N and volume of balloon air. So using the, using the same expression, you will be able to get these two numbers. So for your ease, I will show you the expressions so that you can use them. Okay, you can use these expressions. So delta delta L n will be equal to minus of delta P S P P two minus delta delta P S P one divided by T A plus delta T S H into K into V. And the balloon air weight will be the difference in the P S P s. In fact, you may also be able to use these expressions. Yeah, they are the same actually, they are the same expressions because So now at sea level, we have um, pressure as 101.325 and you increase it by 49 because of super pressure. So what is the answer you get? 4.87, hmm. minus 35 Newtons and do you get 2.9 meter cubes? by finding the volume or the weight and then using the density. Okay. Right. Now let us go to a situation when you are depressurizing the airship. So now you assume that the PSP is 490 okay, and suddenly it becomes 0. That means you had an airship with delta with uh, with PSP of 490, and then suddenly you brought it down to atmospheric pressure. So there is a reduction of 490. So now you take delta PSP as minus 490. 
So, actually you can do it orally. See if it is if it is plus 49, it was minus 35 and 2.9. If it is minus 490, it will simply be 350 and 29. So, if you reduce super pressure very quickly, the balloon has to be filled up with more gas. I mean, balloon has to uh, be pushed out. 